Hello my loves, I have a reading here for someone, so let's get into it. I have here to start out, I have a soldier card here. So guardian of nations, loyalty, honor, integrity, selfless service. So I don't know if someone's in the um, military, the armed services here, but this card is standing out to me, okay? We then move on and I have here a journalist. So I don't know if someone's getting ready for an interview or they're inquiring about you um but i have here interview inquiry reporting so i don't know if the soldier person is inquiring about you or if this is even linked but i have here also friend keeper of trust companion support sharing joy and then i have educator mentor guide teacher okay so this could be you, this could be the person you're dealing with here, but somebody could be an educator or a mentor or a guide or a teacher. Someone could be a soldier here. Somebody may be inquiring about the other and this could be a friend of yours, okay? Um, I then have here glow up. Take a day to spoil yourself. If it makes you beautiful, then do it, okay? So I don't know if you're in your glow up stage right now and maybe they're telling you to take a day and kind of spoil yourself. Get all hooked up, get your hair did, nails done, get a nice massage, whatever you need to do, okay? It looks like here that you may be focusing on your finances at this time, setting some financial, financial goals. And it says here to set and reach your financial goals to achieve financial st stability, okay? Um, I then have self-exploration, so peel off the false persona and get to know yourself to find your truth, okay? So they may want you to take off this mask that you may be wearing, 202 on the clock, um, and get to know yourself, okay? Who you are without all of this, um, whatever this is that you're hiding behind, okay? 212 on the clock. It says here, nutrition, your body is your temple. Try changing your eating habits, okay? So yes, we could all use uh, a change, two, two, three on the clock. <laughs> I hear you there. So they might want you to add some more, um, you know, vegetables, fruits into your diet. You have to remember here that a lot of these foods, two, three, four on the clock, are gonna help you raise your vibration, okay? You want foods that are, that have energy, they're electric, okay? This is gonna help raise your vibration. So you definitely wanna make sure that you're adding these foods in. Of course, not everybody's gonna be perfect, and at least if you're getting them in and you get something else um, on the side, then you got some nutrients in, okay? But yes, they want you to kind of change those eating habits a little bit and then they also want you to change a bad habit that you may be holding on to okay kill a bad habit drinking overeating or anything else that is not serving you okay so you may have some kind of a habit that you're holding on to it could be alcohol drugs overeating anything that's not serving you only you will know but spirit sees it and they're asking you to kill it okay <laughs> don't kill the messenger <laughs> And then they also want you to declutter, let go of old items, create a new sacred space for yourself, okay? So 333 on the clock, they want you to go through and declutter your home. Um, this is something that I've mentioned before that, you know, a lot of times if you, your area, your environment is very cluttered, this will affect you mentally, okay? Um, and it also reflects you. If you're very all over the place mentally, it will reflect in your environment. So clean up your environment, get it organized. It will definitely help you feel better, okay? I have your peacekeeper. Let go of the need to be right, okay? So I don't know if you had some sort of a, you know, argument or whatever it was with someone 414 on the clock but they're asking that you let go of the need to be right sometimes we have to kind of like just give it up especially if you care about this person and you want them in your life you definitely don't want to you know lose them over something that you could have just gotten over you know so think about whatever this is and whether or not it really benefits you to hold on to this okay um and then we have embrace the energy of peace so once again this is 444 on the clock <laughs> more confirmation so they definitely want you to embrace the energy of peace whatever 
whatever this is, they're asking you to let it go. Whatever quarrel that you're having with someone. I have the hermit card here. It could be a Virgo. Um, retreat and recharge. They're asking for you to go within, meditate, recharge your energy, okay? You may need to go within and kind of um, self-reflect and look at situations from a higher point of view, okay? Or a higher perspective. Um, Earth Mother. So you could be dealing with an Earth sign that's Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Um, we have here, feel loved and comforted. So they want for you to feel the love that they're sending you right now. They want for you to feel comforted, okay? Because they are with you, they see you, and they're here for you, okay? So I got some more um, details. I made up my own deck, guys, and I just, I can't can't find one that gives me what I need to know so I have here in the public eye spotlight so this person or you could be in the public eye or in the spotlight at this time okay this is some more information this deck kind of gives you some more information to kind of hone in on who you're dealing with and then we have here once again teacher so somebody could be a mentor guide teacher and then we have up, look up universal law or universal language, okay? So that is something that I don't have time to explain, but it definitely has been pivotal, uh, pivotal to helping me on my journey. And just, um, this is why I speak so much 622 on the clock about keeping your mindset positive and being in good energy, okay? So this will explain a lot more of that. So I definitely recommend you look that up. And then I have here, sometimes the only way Way to learn is to experience okay so sometimes we hold ourselves back from experiences because we think we know the outcome and a lot of times what we see is not what we actually get okay so sometimes we need to go into these situations and experience them, okay, for ourselves. Because a lot of times we hold on to past situations and outcomes and think that that's always going to be the case, and it's not. Um, only when we are silent can we finally hear the truth, okay? So this is about going within and kind of quieting the mind and just listening to what comes up, okay? Okay. This is where you're going to have a lot of truth. There's going to be a lot of things that you realize, things that you kind of reflect back on, things that you might have missed, okay? So this is why they always say to kind of silence everything and go within. This is how you hear the truth, okay? Sometimes people don't explain things in a way that clicks, and that's the way it clicks for me, okay? Content creator. So this person or you could be a content creator, or you could be thinking about doing that, okay? 744 on the clock. Um, I have here younger. So you or this person could be younger. They could live at a distance. They could have brown eyes or you could have brown eyes here. Um, I have here Leo and I have here Capricorn. So this could be you or the other person. I also have here always happy. So you or this other person could always be happy. 808 on the clock. I can relate. That's me. <laughs> and then I have here someone from the past. So this could be somebody from the past. And then I have here 1111 or 1111. Anything to do with this could be a sign as well. Okay. So that is your reading. I hope this helped you all and I hope you have a lovely day. Take care.